Hashtag Nation, we are thrilled to bring in Dan Mitchell. And you'll see all his info right here, because in post-production, Mario will include it all for you in this fancy little swipe video thing that he'll do. Three things that we learned as a Buffalo Bills team going into week eight against the Eagles. In fact, I had no idea what to do with my life that entire week. And the only thing that I could do was just turn on the NFL Red Zone and root for my disappointing fantasy football team. What up, Dom Mafia? Welcome to another edition of the Dom Mafia Report. Say that you ever get upset with ESPN for never covering our beloved Buffalo Bills. Have no fear, Jaboy is filling in that void. This is. Don't you love it when I post-production edit as we go? Who cares? Anyway. We are bringing in Dan Mitchell uh, from the Don Mafia to uh, collab with us. And we talk about the Philadelphia Eagles, the offensive scheme and the defensive scheme uh, for the Buffalo Bills on this coming upcoming weekend. You'll check out the videos. We're going to do one. He's going to do the other. Mario, take it away. Right. No. All right. So. <laughs> Hit. So, uh, ladies and gentlemen, yes, of Hashtag Nation, we were happy enough uh, and, and um, fortunate enough to get uh, Dan Mitchell on our channel. He did a collab with us. And Thursday morning at 6 a.m., as you all know, we're going to have the defensive breakdowns for the Buffalo Bills, the keys to victory against the Philadelphia Eagles. A little bit later in, on Thursday, roughly around noon, we're, we're, we're predicting roughly around noon, you can go over to Dan's channel. Link will be in the description. You can go right over to his channel and check him out and check us out as well. Uh, the offensive keys to victory for the Buffalo Bills, two go six and one against the Philadelphia Eagles. So be sure to stay tuned for that tomorrow morning and tomorrow afternoon and Paul I hate you and we're all good so thank you for joining us and we are out